2014, uh, it's the 100th anniversary of Mother's Day. And we want to tell you a little bit about how it all began. Now, the idea of Mother's Day came from a woman named Anna Jarvis. And in 1914, Anna's mother passed away. And on the second anniversary of her mother's death, Anna announced her plans to establish a day to honor mothers. Now, many, many years, Anna wrote letters to the president. Uh, she wrote to President Wil Woodrow Wilson, campaigning to have Mother's Day officially recognized. And then in 1914, President Wilson granted Anna her wish, issued a proclamation stating that the second, May, second Sunday of May, from that point forward, would be Mother's Day. Now, Hallmark started creating Mother, Mother's Day cards in the early, early 20s, and we have a few of their original designs to show you through the years. So let's take a look at them right now. In the 1920s, the price of a Hallmark Mother's Day card ranged from 15 to 25 cents. Designs were often hand-painted, featuring flowers and gardens like this one. In the late 20s and early 30s, household appliances or daily chores were often depicted on greeting cards like this one that addresses the love that clings to mother's binding apron strings. In the 40s, Hallmark began creating cards for other special women in our lives like this one, a Mother's Day greeting to my aunt. The original price of this card was 10 cents. The changing concept of motherhood gradually became apparent in the late office scenes began to appear on Mother's Day cards as more women, including women with children, began working outside the home. Then, in the 80s, humorous card options with simple designs became more popular with the launch of Hallmark's funny shoebox greetings. Now, the artwork and messages found in Hallmark's greeting cards today continue to represent the traditions of Mother's Day while keeping up to date on all those modern trends that are out there. They have everything, and I mean everything. They have the traditional cards um, for, for mom. They have cards for the modern mom. They also have wonderful selections of humorous cards for that mom with the funny bone, like right. you have, because you love to laugh. Yes, and then there's, uh, there's just all sorts of amazing uh, cards out there for all different kinds of moms. You know, I love receiving cards, especially the Hallmark cards. And mm -hmm. you know, my daughters and my, my, kid, my sons to always write something special in it. And they're keep keepsakes. Yeah. I keep every Everyone. single mm -hmm. one of them. And this year, Hallmark wants to help celebrate new moms and those who are expecting for the first time through their 100 first time mom sweepstakes between today and april 30th go to newsroom.hallmark.com forward slash 100 moms you see it right there in the bottom of your screen nominate a recent or soon to be first time mom she could be one of 100 people to receive a 100 dollars prize packed full of all of these wonderful hallmark products look that at that basket great. full of stuff and uh, by nominating someone you could all you will also be entered for a chance to win $100 Hallmark Gold Crown card for yourself. So you can enter, you can enter me. Enter me. Uh, I will. <laughs> yeah. I will nominate you, okay, and hopefully you. I can. <laughs> No, okay. no. Okay, we're we just kidding. Play. All right, I can't play. All right, you can go to our website at hallmarkchannel.com forward slash home and family. And for all the descriptions of everything, it will be in our goodie basket. You can look up at you can look it up at our sweepstakes um, rules. And for complete sweepstake rules, you can go to newsroom.hallmark.com forward slash 100 moms. All the information is right there on the You're screen. You're still the number one mom. Thank well, you. my mom's the number one mom. Okay. You're the number two mom. Thanks, Mark. Perfect. Okay. Well, coming back, Dr. JJ has another life-saving tip. Don't go away. Um.